G'day gamers, what do you think of that clip? That was Escalation from about two or three weeks ago. Just for one of the best rounds I did of Escalation on US, US West Coast servers. And I just thought I'd throw that in there, but you're probably wondering what the title means, why by? What do I do for views? Now, I'm in a bit of a conundrum at the moment because peeps, I'm out here walking my dog at the moment, as you can see that, ruckus in full action. I don't know how this video is going to turn out, but anyway, stay close, ruckus. Um, is. <laughs> My reaction video. Now, I've said to you I don't like reaction videos, but both my reaction videos have got over 100 views, right? Now, I aim pretty low for my videos. I really, really do, peeps. I really, really do, but I do like views. And, you know, my average view count now is about anywhere from 20 to 40. That's my average how I see it. And we get more likes and dislikes, and I get a few comments here and there. But I'm not enjoying. I mean, don't get me wrong, I still like playing Gears of War 4, but I don't really jump at it. And this is predominantly was a Gears channel, still will be. But I'm loving Titanfall, but I don't get many Titanfall views. So I think for it to change things up a bit, and tell me what you think in the comments section down below, peeps. Do I do reaction videos on game trailers? Because there's so many game trailers out there, and no many people do them. And I was just thinking, what do you think, you know, and, and it won't be clickbait because I'll put reaction like I did on before so you know I'm reacting to a video so if you choose not to watch it, you don't have to, but my last video is up to 278 views, it's got 10 likes, it's got quite a few comments and it's been quite positive and I'm not going to do it on other people's YouTube videos unless they want me to, <laughs> God forbid you do it on mine first before I do it to yours, but tell me what you think in the comment section down below because I enjoy getting those views and the reason I'm going this way is because there's a YouTuber by Grey Disciple and he said, everybody does YouTube for views and view it as a business. And so sometimes you're gonna to have to do videos you don't wanna do, but other people do and you get the enjoyment out of the views. If you understand where I'm coming from. So tell me what you think, people, because I've just come back from work, had a long day at work and I'm walking the dog, but I'm so stoked because the update for Titanfall two's out and everybody's playing, I wanna play the new Monarch and everything, I wanna get it down to that, I'm gonna play that. And I'm probably not gonna to touch gears till the weekend, I'm probably not even going to touch play for half an hour or not, I, and that's the honest truth Pete, but tell me what you think, do you want me, and I only do one a week of that, and the other will be Gears and Titanfall that's how it's going to be, uh, Ruckus, leave the birds alone, sorry it's just the dog that's the view of my dog when I take it for a walk so tell me what you think people, tell me what should I do for views? Would you like me doing those kind of views? Because yeah, those videos, would you like me to try something else? I have asked this question before, but I'm getting less time to do videos, but the videos, some of them done here and they're hit and miss. And I'm just trying to gauge and tell me what you think, people. Should I do those kind of react videos? And yes, this will be noobish because I'm holding the camera up and down here like this. It's just in my hand. It's the GoPro, but frag and tag, tell me what you think. Should I do re one reaction video a week? Because I do enjoy the views. I mean, call me a bit of a... It's a narcissistic view, but I love that. Frag and tab, be good of those that own you. Catch your mofos on the battlefield and get time for two for fuck's sake. I'm being serious, Pete.
it's a game to get catches.